Hey folks, Lord Thermic back here again with you. We are on Rolling Hills map I have so impatiently waited for. <laughs> he said it was coming out, it's coming out. I'm waiting, 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 couldn't wait for it. But this is a map I plan on doing a whole lot too until something along the lines of UMRV comes out and checking it out. But uh, yeah, no, this guy uh, done a lot of mod uh, done a lot of modding. I mean, he makes it look so simple and he just kind of does things. And I'm kind of like so jealous because of it but he uh can't go in there i can't go in there i can't go in there okay oh it's a house no it's a house it's a house it's a cow can't go in the house but you can see inside there there's bushes in the house <coughs> but he's done a lot of mods maps uh umrv was he had a team i think he worked with and they were highly detailed maps um, at this point, I don't believe any of the doors are currently active. Uh, that's a scripting thing that they're still figuring out. And, yeah, you can see somebody missed this. Who, who missed this one? Seriously, who missed that one? Who missed that tree peeking through? That tree should have been bumped over. But, uh, you know, he did a lot of maps. And this is a beta, so, you know, don't get me wrong. It's a great map. Oh, man, if that opens someday. Oh, that is great. Might have to go ahead and edit that just so that opens. Can we get can we get through there? See, I'm like totally losing track of my. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He's got the rest of the doors open. Some little things I think I can change on my own. Nice Quonset hut. Jeez, this thing's deep. Anyway, he's done UMRV. If you played it, you know how highly detailed it is. I like that that one's shifting and leaning. Actually old broken down rusty thing oh he's got those god awful trees in here i hate those god awful trees realistic natural looking yes like them no but this is like our main farm as from what i can tell i kind of like it holy jesus those dryers are loud Ooh, look at the lovely water plate <coughs> bit of a, a hiccup between the audio sounds, but I'll just hang out here for a second. Yeah, you can hear it. A little bit of a hit, 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 hiccup between them, but you know what? I'll take that any day of the week. So, the first thing I think we're going to do, since we own nothing, is we're going to have to buy us a, a truck or something. Nice mailbox. Wish I had a mailbox. <coughs> Let's see here. Let's go with... No, we're going to go with, with this one. Let's go like that. Now, let us see where that ends up. Okay. All right. All right. Sorry. Checking on something. My bad. I'll just hop out here. Where are we at? We're at Miller's Feed and Seed, Purina, Can't Show Feeds. Gotta love it. Difference you can see. Um, got us a gas tank over here. Looks like a wood chip cell point. Cotton cell point, bale cell point. What was in the first one? Oh, then seed fertilizer, solid. That is. Can I go in? No, I can't go in. Darn. Scripting again. Scripting. 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 Work on your vehicles there. Buy your vehicles over here. Very nice. Well done. Well done. Do like it. Sorry, I'm going over the top. Can't help it. <coughs> So if we uh, take a look at the map here, let's see, we're here, on the far left, Mitchell Farm is over here, and currently, kind of bordered by the roads. Rose Acres, God, we're going to have to go check out Rose Acres too. Nice little map, some fields square-ish. <coughs> Some fields, definitely not squares. This is my kind of land up here. 
where I grew up. Not over the top price wise. I mean, two, let's see, that's three, five, seven, you know, not even a million dollars. I know I say not only, uh, even a million dollars, but you know what I mean. Kellogg Farm will cost you 279 Mitchell will cost you 239 and Rose will cost you 64 one There you go. One heck of a big deal right behind you. That one's a very interesting field. The Rolling Hills Co-op. Blazing Saddles Boarding. Oh, there's a Wilson Farm over here. There's like a, a one, two, is there only three, four, one, two, three, four, five. You got six farms on this map. Not sure what this is yet, but we're going to have to go take a look. Where to start? <coughs> Let's take a drive. Let's take a drive the other direction. Um, but let's go the, uh, huh, let's, let's run into the pole first. Let's go the other way. White truck on a farm. Gotta love it. On the main highway here. Nice highway. The banks look, I mean. We've got this place over here. This isn't even, like, listed. It could easily be a farm. Whoa, if we don't end up in that blessed ditch. You gotta be careful. You gotta drive sensibly. Old dilapidated house. Dilapidated? Dilapidated. Yeah, broken down house. Oh, you've even got a wee bit of a, of a path going back here. Now granted, you can't get into any of these barns, but what... Needs plowing. Fertilize 100%. <coughs> but this is like a farm in and of itself if you could get rid of the buildings. Or if they opened. But this is Wilson Farm. It's an empty little place. I could probably spend hours looking through this map. Hey, farming boy, how you doing? Oh, I'm driving like a maniac. <coughs> Turn around there. All right, let's see here. <sighs> Which uh, let's go to the right. Let's check out the farms first, the fields first, I should say. So we've got <coughs> a great way to kill yourself right there. I'm checking out a new map. Did you not read the description? Seriously. I want to go check that out. Run through here. Bushes and weeds. And you know what? That can go away. What do we have over here? Oh. Yep. About par for the course, isn't it? The old farmyard that was forgotten. Oh, cell phone tower. Nice, love it. <coughs> Let's head over there. Let's go around. Oh, this is a co-op. All right, we'll come back to the co-op. I'm too fast for that. We get the truck. All right. So let's get back on the road, shall we? Cut through over here, didn't we? Did we? Didn't we? I don't remember. Yeah, we did. We found ourselves a little bit of spot over here, around the edge of the field. Looks like there's another farmhouse off to the right. Is that Kellogg Farms over there? Looks bigger on the map. It's well, it's it's big. What am I saying? This map is big. <coughs> We're gonna run to Kellogg Farms. That looks like it's got the feel of a um, cow area, just because.
of the fact that it's, it's bordered by grass. It's got all this this grass area. I'm gonna drive back in here. I like the water cut down. You got a little bit of a barn here. Bad barn there. You got this one here. This is, is this a bank barn. Did I just run through that fence? I did. No collision on the fence. Oh, I know people that'll be happy with that. I want to go to the top of this barn. I want to get up in there. That's where I want to be. I want to be upstairs. <coughs> Where's the stairs? Where's the heel off entrance? Come on. That's a bummer. I want to go up in it. Well, here's a quaint little shed. Got a big brand new one. With office space. Just in case you ever get bored, you can go up here and have your own little private space. You got your own silo system and dryer again. Very nice. So that's Kellogg Farm. You've got all this land out here. Till you hit the corner of that field, but you've got all this gray, this grassland over here. This <coughs> either sheep or cattle. One of the two. Assume you can access this. Can you access this? Fence goes down there, cuts up the other side. It's our house. It's a good thing I'm fast, isn't it? I haven't seen an inway yet. Inway, is that a word? You dead end in the forest, aka a the edge of the map. Back at the fence. <coughs> Excuse me. And then we come back to the barn. But. You can go through that. It's like no actual way in. True to life. I mean, you can go through the barn here, but you're getting very big equipment through there. We we'll have to see what we can do. Make do with that. Because then we're field 17 behind us. Big field. All right. So that is Kellogg Farm. which I have taken a liking to. <coughs> Excuse me. I like the long road back to the back, you know, and it just feels right, at least for the Midwest. I assume that's water back there in that little brown spot, that little triangle between the fields. No, it's a spot of forest. Okay. Hey, Perrin. How you doing? And it just runs us off to the edge. Yep, there's no collision. Could you tell? <coughs> but I like that spot. I think that's going to grow on me quite significantly. run up here and we're gonna check out field 28. I'm good. Check it out a map. New first look map. So that, oh that's for that. No. Wait a minute here. That's what I want to check out right here. This is a little bit. You can see there's a like a quite an aggressive hill here. So this is put in as a waterway. 
Yeah, you can pause these together. Yes, I've already downloaded it. Whoops, going through the corn. So they got, he's got a waterway put in here. Well, not a waterway, but a, uh, oh, I'm just not coming up with the words today. They're just gone. Bye bye, see ya, woo -hoo. Whoa, hey. <coughs> An erosion spot of grass. Let's keep the erosion down. You've got a nice little valley down there. And then we are back at the road. Thank God for physics. Oh, look at the lovely bridge. <coughs> We're going to come back to that bridge in just a second because we got a couple farms we got to check out right over here. It's a nice little spot there. That's Gilchrist Farms. Got his little own road going down over the hill. Oh man, I think I'm in love with this map. I'm loving it. All right, we'll just park here because, well, we ran into a building. Nice building here. Little shop and storage up above. Good spot over here. And you still got plenty of room to jack stuff in here. Now, the one thing this one doesn't seem to have is crop storage. Don't have anything alike there. Got spot trees over here. <coughs> Run through the corn here real quick. Lost myself on the map there for a second. The creek running by. Spot trees here. The god awful trees. I know. It's not pumping it very good. It's making me mad. It's either my internet or YouTube being a turd. I'm not sure which. So this is a nice little farm that you'd have to do some work with. Nice house, so it looks like it's brought in from 17. But if you notice, whoops, I need to learn to drive. Do I want to go that way? I want to go that way. <coughs> no, I don't. I want to finish out what I was doing first. I get back on the main road. Nope, my driving is not realistic today. Yes, you can get over it. <laughs> We're gonna check out a few other things. I see this little... What's this? Well, this is Murphy's farm. I almost missed Murphy's farm. Murphy's got a little farm here. He would be a little tinker farm. Do you have a grain dryer here? Yeah, but you, well, you got the sound of it. I don't see actual placeable area for taking crops in, but ooh, loud. At this farm here, on Murphy's farm, the barn is a no-go in the yo. Just a little spot you can have. Neat little area, okay. Now just up here to the right is a something I'm wanting to check out. Right here. Goes to somebody else's house. Whoa, easy, easy. That's a heck of a road into their house. Good luck plowing that in the winter. I bet the Australians know all about that. So you just got a little house over here. With a heck of a view. Not much of a farm area. But, neat little addition. Okay. Let's go. Really? There we go. Thought I was going to be stuck there for a second. Calling for help. <coughs> placing trees. God, he placed all these trees. I can't imagine placing trees. I think I'd lose my mind. Okay, so up here on the right we have a something else. I think the animal dealer. don't see there we are I 
I like the animal dealer. It's different. Very different. In fact... Oh, nifty, nifty, nifty. Very nifty. Um, I want to get in there. I mean, I can't jump that high. I'll look in there. Whoops, getting stuck on things. Of course, I could just go in through the door. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's see, there we are. I just pressed R and boom. You got pigs, cows, horses, sheeps. Most excellent. Yeah, I'm supposed to be pushing 1080 Karen. And uh, it, it didn't want to. Don't ask me why. I don't know. But you can ask me why. I still won't know. Okay. Over here is the co op which is right next to where we started. So can you... Can you actually get crops? Oh, well, I have to check that out in the future. And then back here... Got a great place to get rid of our crops. And yeah, make tons of money. Okay. <coughs> Onward and upward. not try this at home. I'm doing 75 miles an hour. This curve is not rated for 75 miles an hour, I'll tell you that much. Okay, we're going to take a left here. We're going to head out into the countryside, if you will. Welcome back to that house. Out we go. Out into Never Never Land. there are fields just seemingly for miles. I love the water washways, the erosion areas, erosion control areas in between the fields. I mean, granted, you can pile them all together and make one ginormical field, but not 100% what the area is made for. You have some major erosion issues. <coughs> Roads leading everywhere. Looks like there's a forest on the back side of one. We're going to head back. We're going to head to the other side of the map. I like the way it's divided up, yet not divided up. It's separate. The farms are somewhat close to each other, but yet not all the farmland is. Okay. No traffic? Good. I looked. Alright, let's go across that bridge now, huh? See off the left, there's a large grove of trees. Shows up the map as the brown spot. Got your lovely little fields to the right. Oh, yeah, that's cell phone tower out there. Okay. Then over yonder here. Edge of the map, more fields. See, this is where we get in the field, and up right up ahead, I think I see Mitchell Farms. And I believe that's Rose Acres off to the right. <coughs> Our dryer again. Oh yeah, this is where we started Mitchell Farms. Probably the most prominent farm in the map. Also where you start when you launch the game. Until you place your own farm. Kellogg Farm is still Kellogg Family Farm is still my my go-to farm at this point. 
right? Oh, no, that wasn't. This is Rose Acres here. Let's see what Rose Acres is all about. It feels like it should be a whole horse thing, fencing and everything. Didn't get to watch all his videos, but yeah, that, that definitely feels like horses there. I just wonder. That's 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 so horse, but I don't see like a uh, horse by trigger, so I don't know that it's necessarily is 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 nice house, four stall garage. Perfect. No grain dryer or anything. Just a great place for horses. <coughs> Alright. Well, this is going to kind of about wrap us up, isn't it? It's the last farm to check out. Oh, we got. Oh, no, that's Mitchell Farms. That's back from where I came from. Wait a minute. I don't remember seeing that entryway in the bottom. I don't know if console is getting this map. I haven't checked this website lately. At, at last I knew, it uh, it wasn't. I didn't see this little place. Hide your pickup truck down here. Look at that. Ha ha. You should never find me. This door needs adjustment. It needs to open out to the back. Anyway, between Mitchell Farm and Kellogg Farm, those are like my two favorite places. Can I go and visit Kellogg Farm? I can't visit it directly. Hmm. Four hundred thousand units. Hmm. <coughs> you can uh, check the website at the bottom uh, in the description. Where he's got that fertilizing field 17. Just gotta see, like they show on this map, they don't show on this map. Now, granted, we are in beta version. Where is field 17? Oh, field 17. Oh my god, that's big. Beans and corn, beans and corn, all the way around, beans and corn. But yeah, overall, really nice map. Really like it. Can't wait to play on it. Not today. Not tomorrow. Maybe this weekend. If not, Sunday for sure. So, ah, oh, shoot. I hope you guys enjoyed looking at this map with me. I enjoyed checking it out. I'm very excited to play on it. If you are as well, or if you want to check it out, the link is down below to his Facebook page where you can download it directly from him. Uh, otherwise, uh, you know, just kind of hang out, watch what I got going on. That would be awesome. But thanks, guys, very much for watching. Do appreciate you being here. Hope you enjoyed the map. Hope you enjoyed the video. But I'm Lord Thunder Monkey, and I will see you next time.